after a grueling campaign to get here, we are at the championship round on the Sports IQ Showdown's Ultimate NFL Trivia Bracket. 16 creators started in this single elimination tournament, but just two players remain, and they are looking to become the Hammers' Ultimate NFL Trivia Mind. So, let's get to the championship round and see who comes out on top. Smash that like button if you enjoy this one along the way, and subscribe to see what we have cooking up in the future at the Hammer Betting Network. But it's time to meet the players. We've been building it up all season and we are finally here. It is the championship round on the Sports IQ Showdown. Hitman and TA have fought tooth and nail to get to this point in the competition. And now only they stand between each other and the glory and maybe most importantly, the bragging rights in the Hammer Betting Network. So Hitman, you got to this stage of competition through the first tiebreaker against the favorite Eric Eager. You already slayed one giant. Potentially, you have to slay another one here as we get to the final. Are you confident heading into this one against TA? I'm like Hulk Hogan. I slammed Andre the Giant. I don't have a problem going against Macho Man Randy Savage right now. Let's do it. I'm Jimmy Snooker. I'm not Macho Man. Come on. <laughs> uh, I TA, like the top rope. What's your confidence level heading into this one? You obviously beat George Lafitas to get here. You've uh, done really well to get to this stage, the two seed. You confident you can take down Hitman? Hitman's good. I, I, I It all depends on the topics. That's I think all of these are uh, topic dependent, so uh, it could go either way. Of course. And as always, I have no influence or control over these topics. We head over to draftparty.net to get the quiz started today. As a reminder to all of our viewers watching this one, it is a best of three series. So there's three possible quizzes. This is just the first one here. There's 25 possible answers. The better your answer, the more points you rack up. The more points you rack up, obviously the most points is the winner on the quiz and on the round. So we'll have eight possible answers each in a snake draft format. Hitman will be the lead off in the first quiz on a fantasy question. Perhaps this one can throw a little bit of problems into either of our players. It is the most regular season fantasy points in standard scoring by a non-quarterback since 2000 through the 2022 season. So not including the season that is currently ongoing at the time of recording. As I said, Draft Party is the host of these quizzes. You want to play along with any of these quizzes, head to the link in the description or just simply type in draftparty.net in your browser. Okay, Hitman, uh, feel free to take some more time to look. But if you, ha if you have had your look and you have an answer, you are the leadoff. All day, Adrian Peterson. All right. AP, out the gate. And yes, number one. Peterson. Oh, he's got that and more. Adrian Peterson. Goodbye. 25 points for Hitman for the best available answer. Uh, Cleve TA, we move to you. You have two consecutive guesses now. I mean, Jacob, I think I went, I think, uh, uh, I have, oh, I was going second three times last last uh, round, and you start me <laughs> off again. Like this is talk about a handicap match. I'm uh, sorry, Andre the Giant versus eight guys. Uh, all right, <laughs> so let's see here. Now I got to really concentrate since 2000. So this is total points, right? Since 2000, yeah. not per year. Oh, there's some interesting names on this list. Wow, there's there's a bunch of guys that had like just monster short term you know, careers that put up big numbers. I'm trying to weigh it versus uh, guys who had longer careers. This, I mean, one was easy. Yeah, that um, one really sticks out. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go with Todd Gurley, but I don't feel confident at all. Okay, <laughs> Todd Gurley is TA's first pick. And oh my God. Gurley oh, is boy. atrocious. This is unbelievable. Oh my gosh. I, I mean. <laughs> Six points for the 20th seed and all of a sudden, the first round of the oh championship has opened up for Hitman. But TA, you have another pick to try and make amends here and get yourself back into the action oh a bit. That's what I was telling you. This one is tough. <laughs> this is tough. <laughs> I'll go with Marshawn Lynch for the other one. All right. Go with Beast Mode Marshawn Lynch. He's number eight. So more sensible. Oh, However, uh, you've made you two picks. Me on this one, Hitman. And you're still behind Hitman, who's made just the one. And Hitman has two mm. in a row here. I'll, I'll be honest. The girly one, like... I wouldn't have taken him there, but I thought Gurley would have been way higher. As would I. As would touchdown I. season. So that was surprising. Um, let me go with first Jamal Charles. Okay. Jamal Charles is oof, right back at the bottom what? of this as well. Jamal Charles. <laughs> Nine points, 17th on the list. So 
This looks like it's going to stump our championship contenders. All right, LaShawn McCoy. LaShawn McCoy is right up there. Great pick. He's the third seed, and that's worth 23 points. Okay, we go back to TA. A little bit more open all of a sudden, especially if you can find that two seed with either of your two picks here. So I'm just going to go with a guy who had longevity, um, who had a bunch of catches, which helps. I'll go with Brandon Marshall. Brandon Marshall ends up as the ninth seed. So decent, 17 points. Decent, another pick good enough, though. We'll go with another guy who had some longevity. He played a lot of years. I'm going to go with Willis McGahee. Okay, Willis McGahee. Is this the big pick that gets him back? It is not. The no. 18 seed, eight points. And again, we go back to Hitman, who has an extra pick in the bag and is still leading on the quiz. I'm pretty confident in this one. I'm going, you remember how long I was taking some of the other ones? I'm going to go quick. Let's go with first Andre Johnson. Feels like this one is appealing to your strengths. Andre Johnson is number seven. So another good haul of points. Okay. And let's go with between two guys, Reggie Wayne. Okay. Reggie Wayne. To solidify the position, he's the number wow. four seed on fire on this quiz. TA I, think is I, I think I know who 24 is. 58. He's played big time catch up here. Um, TA, your two guesses. We need some big ones. Man, I guess, again, I guess it just depends how old you are. <laughs> I'll go with Heinz Ward. <laughs> okay. Heinz Ward. Look at his playing longevity. Is the 11 seed. So with three picks remaining each, you are in a bit of a hole here. Yeah. You are down by 34 points. Give me Priest Holmes only because he was like my favorite player for a while back in the old days. <laughs> Priest Holmes is the 16 seed, 10 points. Uh, mathematically speaking, I, I think it's possible Hitman can wrap this one up on his turn it's, here. It's, Let's go to it's over right here, Jacob. Ezekiel Elliott is 24 okay. points. That's Zeke what I'm going to say. Is 13 <laughs> points. Wow. Zeke It's going to be the kickers, isn't it? You're going to get us with points. the kickers. Man, All right. You know, I didn't think about, I really didn't think about the kickers. I really I didn't. Like they're in there for Two a picks remaining each. However, hey, man, I think you wrap it up. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, because, you know, it's funny. There's no other, like Isaac Bruce played a lot in before 2000. He had a few years. Keenan Allen didn't score. He was more of a PPR guy. This is standard scoring. I wonder if one of the kickers ends up being, uh, I'm going to say Amon Green, but. So uh, we'll, we'll, still, but, we've uh, kept it interesting here, uh, but Hitman, I believe any pick right now, I, I actually think the quiz might already be mathematically over. And I think any number here would solidify that. So Amon Green yeah. as the 12 seed was 14 points is a solid offering. And I'm I think take two kickers. Can I take two kickers or am I done? Yeah, you can take two kickers, but you're down by 51 points. <laughs> the maximum amount of points you could score on this turn is 45 and Hitman still has to go again. So unfortunately for you, Hitman has won round number one, but please feel free to enlighten us <laughs> with some kicking content. Actually, Thomas Jones probably did all right, but I'll go with Sebastian Janikowski. Yes. Wow. 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 24 wow. points. Waited too long to pull that one out. Wow. Yeah. Too little, and too then... late. <laughs> I'm trying to think who the other guy would be. I mean, uh, I mean, suck up. <laughs> Phil Dawson played a while with the Browns. Uh, man, let, let, let's go with Phil Dawson just for my All brownies. Right. Phil Dawson is oh, wow. the, the top <laughs> seed. Is a, I mean, you're giving us a kicker. Available, but it doesn't you're matter. Kicker, uh, questions in the finale. Wow. Amazing. So it doesn't matter because Hitman has won round number one. Uh, he has another pick he could make, but he's up by six. It's fun to see the kickers are there. Um, Hitman, oh just one God. more one more pick and we can just see the whole overall list. Matt Bryant. <laughs> All right. Matt Bryant is the best available, number six. So we saved the best for last as far as the picks are concerned. Um, some interesting ones to know. Thomas Jones is the best remaining for the 10 seed, but uh, sleeping on the kickers and not finding that wow. too early perhaps cost TA round number one. He has to win now back-to-back -back quizzes to stand any chance to get this championship. Let's Let me guess Hitman's first. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, we go to the second quiz. Yes, Hitman is now the oh, second. Wow. 
to answer here. Cleetia, you are the lead off. You have the luxury of going first. Sometimes a luxury, sometimes a curse. But the question is, most rushing yards in the first 100 regular season games of their career. I don't want to look like I'm helping, but I feel like we have a pretty solid candidate to go first here. Uh, TA, please well, take it away. Yeah, I don't think it's as obvious as you might think. Um, but it's safe. So I'll go with Adrian Peterson, but I don't think it's a clear uh, 25. Yeah, Let's see. I agree. It's, I think I he's think up it's there. But I don't think yeah, it's not I think you both. Okay, I think you both would have picked him first. Uh, but anyways, let's see He'll if be he has the right pick. Four. Adrian Peterson is number two. Okay. Yeah, I, I think I know number one. But okay. That, but I wanted to. I wanted to say, but I don't want a, a six to well, start like last time. This is perhaps the the with the luxury of going second. Perhaps the safe yeah. one showcases who is going to be number one. We'll see if Hitman can find it with his two picks here. I'll go with Eric Dickerson. Okay, Eric Dickerson is the number one seed. 2,105 yards in his second year. Still the single season rushing record. Very well let done. Get, let me get Emmett Smith. Emmett Smith is number three on the list. That is 23 points. Okay, so Hitman cleaning up here, getting the best to available. Back to TA in the must win quiz. I mean, this is a guy that definitely had a ton of yardage early. Um, I'll go with Eddie George. Okay. Eddie George is the sixth best. 20 points. Solid pick. Okay. Um, I will go with Marshall Falk as the next one. All right. Marshall Falk is the eighth seed. 18 points. So decent, but... <laughs> I'm in danger. In the championship round, we have the best players. Hitman. I'm certainly I'm going I'm going quick, Jacob. No hesitation. Uh Thurman Thomas. Kick him while he's down. Thurman Thomas is number five, second best available. Okay. And the best available is going to be Chris Johnson. Yeah, Calling that was gonna be shot. my pick. That was gonna <laughs> be my I thought I didn't think you would take him. <laughs> Calling his shot, Babe Ruth style. Chris Johnson is the number four seed. Yeah, I knew, I knew. I, that was one of those where I, I was strategic. I didn't think he would take them, so I was waiting. <laughs> oh, <laughs> all right. In all right. a hole here, TA. You're down by 29. However, you do have an extra pick. Five for yourself. Hitman has four remaining. Oh, man. Now we got a bunch of guys. Um, let me go with Corey Dillon. Okay. That's a good one. Corey Dillon. Get back into the quiz. He is the best available number seven. Great job, but you need to keep keep on coming with the great picks yeah. here. See, now we're now we're talking. These are some names now. I'm gonna go with Thomas Jones. All right. Thomas Jones at the halfway stage. TA down by 10. Thomas Jones will earn him 12 points. He's the 14th seed. And again, an opening for Hitman to pile on the pressure. I love how so many people watching this see Michael Pittman and they're thinking the wide receiver and not thinking the Buccaneers running back that was jacked as hell. You had the long <laughs> neck. Yeah. That's that's uh, what uh, I was doing and it didn't make sense to me. Now yeah. it <laughs> showing your age, Jacob. Showing your age. Yeah. Yeah, my football knowledge. I mean, I was, I was Jacob and I are probably a pretty similar age. I'm just a huge <laughs> loser with the NFL. <laughs> um let's go with Mark Ingram. Okay. Mark Ingram is the 13th seed. So 13 points. So not taking full advantage of that spot, but another pick here. Okay. Let's go with Alfred Morris. That's good. Alfred one. Morris. So three picks okay. remaining each. Hitman is up by 11. Good Alfred start to his career. Will extend the lead by 14 points. I'll say just 14 points because there's three better available. So all of a sudden, TA can really make up a bit of ground here. That would have been my pick, too. Um, so that was a, a good one, I think. Um, and I'm down a ton, huh? Yeah, you need you really need to find the nine and ten here. <laughs> no pressure. No pressure. See, button. Hitman's looking it up. Talk about cheating. I mean, he's looking up right now. <laughs> most rushing yards. Uh, there we go. Look, I'm sending a text <laughs> message. It, all right, all right. This is under protest. It's all. It's, it's all good. Fezzik. He said, "How can Miami be plus three versus Buffalo when they were minus two versus Dallas?" And I got to explain <laughs> them the injuries. <laughs> oh man. 
Oh gosh, <laughs> this is a. Uh... You know, I'm gonna go just because this guy had some some good early seasons. Go with Darren McFadden. Okay, he was great. Darren as McFadden. We don't necessarily mathematically need the nine and ten here, but certainly would help. Darren McFadden is the 15th seed, so on the wrong side wrong of the side gap of here. So, ooh, at this point, we're in almost desperation hour. Cleve TA is down by 14 <laughs> points. He has two picks remaining. And it's possible that if this one isn't up to snuff, he will not return for his final pick. Oh, man, TA. Embarrassing. Now there's a lot of pressure. This is embarrassing. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna. So this is like the kicker stuff. I, I'm just gonna go off the board because I, I have to. I have to. Yeah, uh, I know who you're taking. I have to reach. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna take Randall Cunningham yeah. just because I, I, I need to do something. I feel like these these random things are on here for a reason. Yeah. They're not. They're on there to be last. So I'll take Randall Cunningham. Okay, Randall yeah, Cunningham. going to be a good pick. Is not a good pick. Not a good pick at all. Oh. The 20th seed is six points. Hitman, wow. I believe, yes, this pick could even wrap up the entire Sports IQ Showdown you know, Ultimate <laughs> NFL Trivia Bracket. I'm surprised that Cunningham didn't come in higher. I, I really am. Hey man, you're up by eight points. The best available would give you 17, which would lead the second best available as 16 points, which would more than be sufficient enough to win this quiz. And you have I, two uh, picks. Well, let me ask you, Jacob, do you know who Steven Davis is? <laughs> oh, you better. Hey man, I don't know how old he is. I am with some of these. <laughs> I'm, 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 uh, Panthers and Redskins running back, Steven Davis, we're going to go who, with. When did he play? Uh, like two thousands. Yeah, two thousand. I I I was born in ninety nine. So so unless it's like late two thousands beyond, then I have no clue. But Stephen Davis. The important thing is, you know, Stephen Davis is this to wrap up the championship. He is the ten seed, the best available, and go. that is yes, indeed enough to wrap it up and <laughs> nullify it up by twenty four points. Hitman is the champion on the Sports IQ Showdowns ultimate nfl trivia bracket congratulations to hitman uh round of applause i imagine everyone watching is also applauding him let's go to our final screen here all right ta we'll hear from you first of all where do you think it went wrong today down in just the two quizzes and uh with all due respect not a ton of fight provided in either of them no 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 that was a really poor showing so uh, congrats to hitman um, you know, if I would have gotten the number one pick on the first one, things could have been different uh, yep. because that was the most obvious and the only one. But yeah, when we're looking at fantasy football stats as a uh, as one of the topics, it's, it's <laughs> not as a clear cut. And I got to yep. pick between kickers, so uh, I'm not going to be excused. But that was not my favorite topic of all time. But uh, uh, he 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 smoked me, so so he gets full credit. And Hitman is grinding to get here. He needed the tiebreaker to get to the final through the semis. But Hitman, any words as the champion and the ultimate NFL trivia mind here at the Hammer Betting Network? Um, first of all, so many of the people I went up against, they're so knowledgeable in the NFL. Like I learned so much stuff like in my handicapping from the people that I went up against. So credit to them. They're great NFL minds. But I do want to say whoever made that bracket and they decided to put me at whatever seed they put me at. Yep. Like, you got to quit. You got to quit. You got to reevaluate things. Next time, you got to do a better job. And uh, now, <laughs> I, as we log off, I put on some Queen. We are the champions. I pop a little bit of champagne. And we go out and celebrate tonight. Yeah, of course, you were the five seed. It was myself and Rob who came up with this seeding. So the, I, I think the company ceases to exist if, if me were to quit but you had go to go do something else jacob go do something else <laughs> you know what it's not as much you jacob it's rob like rob <laughs> do you not know who i am rob come on put some respect on my name rob. hitman well, we corners were, the rob. market on uh on trivia I cornered cornered the market. The market. exactly we will put a ton of credit in your hands as well because you went through alex b smith suma eric eager and ta to get all the way to the final so you took down you took down the four seed, the three, sorry, the four seed, the two seed, and the one seed en route to the crown. Very well deserved. So that wraps up the ultimate NFL trivia bracket. Thank you so much to all of our creators who have played a part in this. And thank you to Hitman and TA for doing 
all these episodes to get all the way to that championship round. Stay tuned for more content right here on the Hammer Betting Network. We have more content in store for you. Subscribe to the channel. And if you enjoyed this one, of course, smash the like, like button to try these quizzes out yourself. Head over to draftparty.net. We'll see you again very soon. Thank you so much for tuning in to the amazing bracket all throughout the NFL season.